Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today, you should know if you clicked on the thumbnail, what we're doing today. Today we're doing more God of War and we're getting so close to the end. A really good episode. I hope that you love it. Please take a second to like the video and we'll just get on to it. Enjoy! Um, moving on. Continuing the quest. Oh, hello. Well, I think I shall do one of these to takey take take maybe a horn of blood mead, perhaps. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, one, two. Oh, this is gonna have to be quick, huh? One, two. Where is the third? Fascinating. Can't be down there, can you? Maybe it becomes apparent if I just try it out. <laughs> Let's just give it the old razzle-dazzle. This is gonna be hard. Oof, okay. Hmm. I'll wait for you to reset because you seem like the longest one, so. I meant to do that. I think this is the longer one. I think C is the longest. We'll do C, then R, then switch. We don't have to switch. Ah! Okay, we just leave you on N. Okay, 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 okay. I got it. I got it. We leave you on N. We'll do C and then R and then just run over and hit it. We don't have to make this harder than it actually is. Just like I do in my normal everyday life. Atreus, open the chest. Oh no, I don't need Atreus for this. Kratos, open the chest. What did we get? A horn of blood mead. I knew it. Maximum rage increased. I wonder what this place looked like in better times. Conan's garb was a beautiful land in its heyday, before the Dwarf King's obsession poisoned his mind. How could he let that happen? The Dwarf blindly trusted in the legend and pursued it without thought to the consequences. This is the result. Trust is a gamble. Like you said, and the Dwarf King lost. Interesting thing for Kratos to say. And I see a rift. Is this going to be a trick or a treat? Or a trick then a treat. Probably a trick then a treat. Rift time. Please don't be an enemy. Please just be a treat. It's an enemy. Yeah, I should have seen that coming. You can't just, you, you can't just. Right out the gate? That's so rude! I can't see you. I can't see anything! I can't see! I'm stuck in the rift! Turn the camera! There's three of you? That's not good. Woo! Woo! Okay. Okay, just full full hoss right out the gate. Fantastic. We can't. We have to use the Blades of Chaos here. We're stuck. We're stuck in between them! Okay, 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 okay. Oh, we have our new thing we can use. This will be great. Hey, look at that. That's 
fantastic, though. That is great. We need to focus a single enemy. Atreus, hit the correct one, please. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna die! We're super gonna die! We're definitely gonna die! Okay. Can't you? Dang it! Oh, I was so close! I don't have a resurrection stone because I already used it. Oh, I was so close. We took a lot of them out. I just, I really got stuck in the rift there. Um, okay. We don't have a resurrection stone, so we don't actually have to go back as long as... I mean, yeah, we'll just, we'll just vibe with, with this restart. Okay. Okay. This time I mean business. Last time I meant leisure. This time I mean business. See? Be ready? Yes, that is that is satisfying A F. Lemon squeezy. There was nothing to it. Why? Why did I even have to redo that? The world may never know. It's a mystery. Actually, it was because I got stuck in the rift. Like, never get stuck in the void, ladies and gentlemen. It will never work out for you. Purest essences of realms. Oh, used to upgrade a powerful talisman. You know what that means. We can upgrade our yellow talismans with that, which is fantastic. But, <laughs> but I want it, please. <laughs> Just let me take, let me take it. I can't take it. I, I don't want to leave you behind, but I must, because I'm not fighting that fight again. I just want you all to know it is with great sadness that I leave that take behind. I don't do it lightly. I don't do it lightly. Okay, great. So, the next thing to do is return to Brock and Sindri's shop. That's all there is to it. That's all that's left. And return to Brock and Sindri's shop we shall. Back over here is here ish. Earth. Back here. I'm good at words. Some say I get paid to say words. Okay. Tell me again how Odin knew we were going to Jotunheim before we did. Odin is extremely clever, you see. Nearly as clever as he thinks he is. And he's a collector of prophecies. If it's about the future, he adds it to his collection. Helps him style himself as all-seeing and all-knowing. But of course, the idea is control. Control of the future, control of his fate. He'd control every realm of every land in every world if he could. Relatable. Every potential pocket of resistance, he seeks to eliminate. 
Even if you've never posed a threat before, he may think one day you might. So you see, it's not important how he knew before you did. It's important that he was right. Interesting. So we're piecing together little little pieces of the puzzle, basically. And Odin somehow managed to obtain a prophecy that Kratos and Atreus would make their way to Jotunheim. Odin wants to go to Jotunheim to end the giants because of this very, very long war and this, you know, centuries old vendetta. And so, ipso facto, Odin wants to get a hold of Kratos and Atreus in order to get to Jotunheim. So, that's why all of this nonsense has been happening. The only piece of the puzzle that we haven't pieced together in the puzzle is why Atreus's mom, whose name starts with an F, but it, her name is not Freya, I think it's Faye, why she requested her ashes be taken to the highest peak in all the realms, which she didn't specifically name as Jotunheim, but we have an inkling that she knew, but we don't know why. Where she falls into this puzzle, if anywhere, we do not yet know. But we're getting there. You boys look right beaming. Well, the squirt does. Can't see squat behind that furzle fuzz you call a beard. Furzle fuzz, eh? We found the materials. But they're so weird. How do you build a piece of armor out of something so... Ephemeral? So... Nanya. Okay. Nanya? Nanya fucking business. Yeah. Trade seat. Saw that coming. We get our ways. Oh. How could I have dared to think Brock would say something ephemeral? No. Instead he says, Nanya. Okay. Okay, we got another heavy runic attack. I hope we don't like this more than the one we just got, because... We just used a bunch of upgrade points. Oh, it does a lot of burn damage. Okay. No, that's not right. That's what we have equipped. This does a lot of damage damage. I like it. And it has a, a quicker cooldown. I think we're going to upgrade that too. Why not? Why not? We're here. Yeah. Okay, cool. So we have both of these. I like them both. I think I'm still digging on Prometheus Flame right now, but I might switch over to Fire of Aries just for funsies. Look at the names of the Axe Runic attacks. Njord's Tempest. Fury of the Ice Troll, Charge of the White Bear, Wrath of the Frost Ancient, Hell's Touch. Then you have Theazi's Talon, Ivaldi's Anvil, Blessings of the Frost, the River of Knives. These are things from Nordic folklore. These are things from the world that we're in right now because this weapon is from the world that we're in right now. This weapon was given to Kratos from Atreus's mom. But all of, come back, all of the heavy runic attacks for the Blades of Chaos, Tartarus Rage, Fire of Ares, Prometheus Flame, those are Greek references because these weapons are from Kratos' Greek heritage. Isn't that interesting? I like it. Yeah, Icarus Storm, Blast of Hephaestus, Spartan Charge, those are all Greek references. Pretty cool. All right, we finished the quest. Hail to the king. Way to go, us. On with the main quest. We are going to get on a boat. Hey, wait for me. Well, keep up. Did you think about that, Atreus? Why do I get the odd feeling we're not supposed to be getting on a boat? <clears throat> Locate Tyr's mysterious door. 
Brock and Sindri made us the key to enter Tyr's hidden cham chamber. I have a feeling it's that door downstairs by the water. Right, right, we're not supposed to get on a boat. All right, dock the boat. I wonder if it's this mysterious door. Is it this one? I don't think it's this one because our compass thing is showing something different. I think we're supposed to not be here. Okay, that's fine. We gotta find the other door. Not that way. We're just gonna keep following the compass. This mysterious door. Ah, yes. Well, this looks very, you know, tear like. So, this is where we meant to be the whole time. Tears rune. This is it. Ooh, fancy. Oh, fancier. Ooh, this is What's looking up? mighty what? underwater here. What is this place? Your guess is as good as mine, little brother. What are these materials? Interesting. Okay. I would guess that... Should I shoot it? You should. Yes! Up we go. Okay. Interesting. There's more crystals up there. I'm feeling very wary, you know? I'm feeling like gotta make sure that we're doing everything right. Okay, well, that's not gonna get us anything. We'll just come in here. The tree. <clears throat> We're underneath the oh, okay. Tower. But why is the floor on the ceiling? Why is the floor on the Those ceiling? Those round doors seem to mirror the ones above. Okay. Why does that look like a stage light? What is that? Up there. Deer use the same magic to protect the Black Rune. Oh. The clue we seek may be inside. Huh. Right next to the Yodanon door. Interesting. But can we reach it? Not from here. Oh, it's behind there. Um, good question. Well, we can't hoist ourselves up. So perhaps we go through this side door that opened that Atreus found. Thanks, Atreus. Fantastic. <clears throat> we'll just keep going then. Well, one inner sanctum within another. Those tapestries. Looks like more giant art. Whatever it's here did for them must have been big. I mean, it seems like Tyr was kind of responsible for hiding them from Odin's wrath. It kind of seems like that was Tyr's kind of whole deal here. Okay, the World Serpent. Treus went in there, but you know we always have to clear up here because what if there's a treasure chest up here? If there is, we would be really sad if we missed it. You know what? I'm getting more lost. Maybe I don't want to be up there just yet. I'm sure we'll come back. We'll come back. Let's go in here first and see what we can learn. Whoa, who are they? The Hall of Tear. They look like they might be giants. Boy, this is the rune for Jotunheim. That's right. And look, we're on the other side of the door. The upside down door. The upside down. What are you thinking? Stand back. Okay. Even I'm like, okay, stand back. Why? What's he going to do? Oh, we're going to turn it? We're gonna lift it. That's a Kratos solution right there.
Extraordinary. The whole room is built on some kind of axle. There's chains on both sides. Without those... <clears throat> we can flip the temple. All right. Do you... what now? <laughs> <laughs> Kratos is like, I'm sure there's a puzzle to solve here, but oh, I think we can just happy. use our manpower. Um... Okay. I don't think they're attacking. Want me to read this one? Are they going to? Boy, on the statues. I see them. It says boy. Hmm. Ominous. Go on. Read. Before the first, after the last. Nothing between, no shadow cast. Alpha. Are you quite sure flipping the temple is the only way to reach them, whatever it is? You said there would be a path. The temple can be flipped. Therefore, we've put the temple. The logic is unassailable. <laughs> unassailable. Unassailable logic. Okay, then I guess we do a one of these. Let's see what that gets us. Huh. Not sure what happens when we recklessly upend a room that's rooted to eight other realms. I'm curious, of course, but it's a leap to imagine it gets us to your night. I don't mind a leap. Well, who knows? Perhaps you and Tyr are the same kind of mad. Certainly there couldn't be some kind of puzzle to solve. No, we just have to flip the whole room on its side. Upside down, no less. Here. Another. It says his name is Bergomir. I think Mother said he was the king of the giants. That's a sad name. Aye, that he was. And quite a bit more. Looks like he had a lot of kids. That, little brother, is what we call an understatement. He's dead, but nobody killed him. Do giants die from old age? They may, though it's rare among the legends. Hmm. Burgle mine. What was it again? Burgle something? Burgle mirror? Um, okay. Burgle mirror! God, what an unfortunate name. Please, nobody name their child Burglemir, please. An army Ooh. of statues. I don't think they're the kind that come to life, if that's what you're worried about. I was. Tyr often said that in the world of PC envisioned, the only soldiers he'd need would be statues. Bless his heart, but the bugger did take himself rather seriously, didn't he? There, where the chains meet, we must find a way around. The only problem is I just keep hearing this very loud clanging and I sort of feel like it's something that wants to fight me. <laughs> and I'm a little scared. Oh, good. Okay. Again it's something that trap. does want to kill me, but at the very least, it's not like alive. So that I keep thinking that tears symbol is an up arrow. It's not. I honestly don't know what the right call is here. I think you have to time it so that you can see that long enough to do that. But you don't want to do that. It'll work, I think. Great. I don't know if that's how we were supposed to do that, but I did it that way. This kind of just looks like a bunch of bones hanging from the ceiling. Well, I'm just gonna take this chest. Don't overthink it, you know? You enter a room full of hanging bones, you take the treasure inside. Don't overthink it, it's simple. There's an easy solution here. Bracers of the World Serpent? Huh? I see. Well, that would be higher in runic, lower in everything else. We will not be equipping those, but we will be smashing that priceless vase. How dare it just sit there being priceless. 
Hmm, yes, this definitely doesn't look like some ritual sacrifice at all. There's definitely a whole head in there. A whole torso, a bunch of feet. I don't much care for the looks of that. Mm-hmm. Okay, we have some red explodey guy. Good. Father. What are we gonna do with the red explodey guy? I'd have thought, brother. Why don't you let the lad carry me for a while? Um, no. I let you miss this. No. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Hmm. Why aren't you going all the way up is my question. You are only going a little bit up. But I don't see any sap around here, which would, oh, sap's on the floor, great. All right, floor, meet your maker. Great. Then I think we just have to get on that. We could get down below it, or would that kill us? You know, it's an impulsive thought. Well, okay, we're not, we can't, we literally can't. So we're just gonna get on it. Why does this still feel like death? Okay, we're just gonna, boop. Oh, okay, right, uh, right, uh-huh. We can't just stand there. <gasps> we were at Brock and Sentry Stop and we didn't get another Resurrection Stone. How much are we gonna regret that? I wonder. I had a thought, Mother. Oh, we gotta do Why this don't again? You let the lad carry me for a while and let you miss this. No. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Hmm. Okay, we're gonna step on the thing. We're gonna step on this thing and then roll, roll. Yeah, we made it. Don't ever think it. Time to do what you do, brother. Take things from the chest. Yeah, that's what Bree does. That's our style. Take another piece of the language cipher. Good. Well, that means nothing to me because I'm not gonna do that side quest. Useless. Leave them in peace. Obviously not referring to us. Leave them in peace. A message from Tyr? Does he mean the giants? Fair enough. He probably does mean the giants. Okay, time to flip. Well, at least break these chains. Can you imagine how much strength you have to have to push from your arms at that angle? Like, <laughs> that is not efficient. Not realm, no, no, not and, not additional difficulty. Oh my God, no, please. Atreus, what are you doing? Get up. Oh my God, look what's happening. Absolute, aren't you dying? Why didn't that do anything to you? I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, his shield wasn't even up. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, you stand in the fiery flame of doom. Watch out. You watch out. That was a difficult, but what? There's more? What? From where? And why? Another one down. What? 
Is it through the other door? Okay, well then I'm not super concerned about it right now. Yeah, wait, wait until I can actually be attacked by you. And then maybe I'll care. I took that. Good, good, good. Okay. Good, yeah, okay. Yeah, I see you now. Bring it on! Give you a taste of your own medicine! Well, not like that, I won't. Wait for it. Wait for it. Ah -ha! A taste of your own medicine and I'm gonna die! Ah! All right, that did not work out like I wanted it to. Oh, wait, did it? He's dead. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> okay, you stay there. Good. And I will just roll on through here without dying. Okay. Punch you to death. Great. Any more? You make quite a formidable duo. Okay. Oh, there is more. Okay, great. Fantastic. Excuse you. Excuse you. Like, what were you thinking? Even trying to be alive right now. You are a dead thing, and you should stay dead. How come there's always more, though? Oh, but watch this. Watch this, though. Goodbye! Oh, that was fantastic. Oh, that was just, just great. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> really sucks to be you. That was just a fancy movement ability. There can't be more! Oh my gosh, why are there always more? Let's just get a Wuffelhost in here. Okay, I'll take you out. Goodbye. Toss ya. Toss ya. And then I'll toss you too. Toss you right into the fire. Yeah. Trace is gonna take care of the rest of you. Okay, one for one. One for one. That's fair. Reasonable. I understand you gotta well, defend yourself, you've got children. But in the end, I come out on top, because I'm Kratos. So... Great. Everybody wins. Everybody being me. And Atreus. Okay. Um, now, to where? Uh, obviously, to here. Okay, the next chains. Good. Okay. Not like that, obviously. Can't get through there. Somewhere like that. Good. Great. Multiple ways to get through that, I suppose. And now, to the left! To do it all again! Follow me. Be right there! Ah, it's the other kind. Variety is so important. Ah, uh, that's a little meta, isn't it? Okay. Just pause you there. I truly do hate this part. I know. Just do a little bit of that. I think this is the not right way. Just do a little bit of that. That doesn't feel right. Why do I feel like I'm about to die? Surely there was a reason I felt like I was about to die. Can't imagine why. Okay. Then surely I should just pause this one just so that I can get an eyeball on that one. Well, I'm gonna have to pause you more. So that I can get an eyeball on that one. And then, I feel like that's not really enough. Room. I truly do hate this part. I know. Ooh. 
And then both of you will go around. Oh, there's an opening there! It's fine! Everything's fine! <laughs> Everything's fine. We did make it through. Why do I feel like this is gonna be a fighty room? Uh, yeah. Yeah. That looks like something that's gonna come to life. Wait. Does it? No. That's like... A Really sad, actually. I wish I had not examined that. I thought that was going to be an ogre. But it's not. Okay. So... But what did that get me? <laughs> Nothing. Good. Oh, I see. I don't see. I really don't see. Okay. Why don't we take you and put you here and see what happens? Rotation. Not the helpful kind of rotation. That looks so murdery. Mm -hmm. If only we knew how timing worked. We went through it anyway! You know, there's a certain amount of death that you have to accept. Okay, and then we open you. And what's inside a treasure chest? <laughs> First, you break everything so that you can get what you want. Then you put it all back together again. Heavy runic attack tosses the blades of chaos towards an enemy and on contact launches Kratos toward them like like flying eagle style and then yeah okay cool more of a single target thing seems like well there is an area of an effect with a concussion blast okay I don't love it Hyperion grapple I don't love it not not my chose not not my drink of choice to quote the tiktoks so um good you're not moving which is exactly how i want you to be however i do need you to be moving so we're gonna have to go back to here take you put you here good Nice and murdery, fantastic, but enables me to get through, which is great. So I'm gonna take you and run and put you, I don't know, here. Now you get out of my way as necessary. Fine, don't run. So Meander. I for one never doubted. Right. 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 Mimir is like, I never had a single doubt ever in my life. Alright, is this gonna be another useless cipher? Survey says. Now we can decipher yes. those 
And the travel run is here too. You wanna go? No. I don't. I won't. You can't make me. Okay. Until gods grow good. Could be quite a week. I guess he means never. Or maybe. Hmm. No. They're just waiting for us. Look at all this health! Not an ounce of hack silver? My goodness. They must expect us to die a lot on these spinny blades of doom. Well, let's take let's take this out. Let's destroy this with our finger strength. Great. More death. Fantastic. Just what I was hoping for. Let's focus one at a time. World for Hearst. Good. I can take this one on. If Atreus is going to kill everybody else, then I'll just destroy you. No problem. There is something behind me, isn't there? I don't even need to use you. I can just destroy you. Destroy you behind you. And destroy you. And I'm sure there's more devastation coming my way, but in the meantime, I'm kind of chilling. I'm just hanging. I'm just hanging out. This is fantastic for me. Thanks, Atreus. You did a lot of work there. All right, cool. Easy peasy. Some might call it lemon squeezy. Some might say that. This battle music is great though. I'm jamming. All right, I think we got everything. Yeah, seems like we did. So. Back through the spinny chamber of doom. Okay, here we go. And oh, oops, excuse me, I'm passing through. Just passing through. Just passing through. Let me avoid the spinny blades of doom. Don't get stuck in the void. We've learned. We've learned the importance of not getting stuck in the void. More voids, more baddies. It's really actually kind of hard to see what's going on with the fire and the enemies, mostly. Great. Just run him into the other guy for sure. To your spinny blade doom. Ah, to my spinny blade doom. Ah. Yeah, just can you come back before I kill you so I can loot your corpse? Oh, you can. Boy. Yes, sir. Time to flip the temple. Yes, sir. What? Just agree to smash. Thing. Flip the temple. It's starting to sound normal. All right. Well, actually, um, there's no more looting to do. Those guys dropped almost nothing. How stingy of them. Hmm. Okay. Well, that being said, can I just say how nice it is that once you solve the spinny blade puzzle of doom, they don't make you have to do it again. They just make it nice and uniform for you. Like, you can chill. You've already solved this. Everybody goes home with all of their limbs. It's really nice. Just quite, quite generous of the game. Okay. 
So, that being said, we've done so much of this good stuff. Ah, I thought so. I thought that's what we had to do. We were just waiting for Atreus. That's reasonable. Brothers, I know what I promised, but in case this doesn't work, just remember, Tyr had good cause to create these obstacles. He's kept Jotunheim out of Odin's reach, but the world is hardly at peace. No, but it's got hope. We're all working together now. We have unity. That's what the rune on the door to this place was telling us. We're on Tyr's path. Yeah, but did Tyr really intend for us to just flip the thing? The whole thing and nothing but the thing? So help your thing? I don't think so. I don't think that's what he meant. But I don't see another option. And the other question I have is... Are we supposed to go that way? I just have to see where that leads. Because I was pretty confident that we just didn't have to go this way yet. But now I'm no longer confident about it. So... Let's just see where this leads. This... To, mm. This is how we got here, isn't it? Oh, it's circular. All roads lead to Rome. Okay, I see. Circles, man. Th that's how they get you. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna flip the temple. We're just gonna flip it. Hey, wait for me. No, I will. I will not. Legs, brother. He knows. Just trying to be helpful. Yeah, because if he doesn't, he might strain his back. Is that, is that why he should lift with his legs? Didn't don't want the god of war to strain his back. Look at him. I don't think he's gonna strain his back. That is such an epic shot. Whoa! <laughs> what a satisfying clip. On the day that brute force is the answer, I'll be quite happy to be on your side, brother. That's great. And we're not dead. That's a plus. That is a plus. Yeah, the there was no way to know that that was going to work. Up to the realm travel room from there. Okay. Up we go then. See that, Mimir? Nobody could do all this alone. All these obstacles. They're just chances to prove we're the ones who can beat them. We may argue. Me and Father. You and Freya. Brock and Sindri. But when we all work together... We do make a good team. And that's Tyr's test. That's why we're gonna make it to Jotunheim. Do you hear that, brother? Lads found his equilibrium. What's that mean? He means you speak wisely, Atreus. And that is good to hear. There's something that... that I feel when I hear that. Because... On the one hand, it feels incredibly oversimplified for such a complex narrative that's been, you know, happening between, you know, gods for ages. To just say, the answer is just to work together. Almost like <laughs> every Sailor Moon episode when she like defeats the big bad villain with the power of friendship, right? It feels reductive almost. But at the same time, there's also something incredibly brilliant about the wisdom of a child when, when something is just so clear to children. When they just have such a clarity of, yeah, it's actually really simple. All you have to do is work together and not be mean to each other. Like, all you have to do is, like, treat each other like you would want to be treated. It's really simple. And it, it is that simple. It is. But at the same time, like, we just get so worked up into complexities that we forget sometimes you can just boil things down to the essence of just be kind. Just be kind to one another. So there's something, something interesting in the play of that conversation that I just had to try and put words to. A 
guess the oh, temple the was realm need to be flat. Travel crystal. Look, the tree's upside down. Or are we? I'm not sure anymore. Which one is it? Who's upside down? I I honestly are we just supposed are we Oh right, 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 right. I got confused because what Okay, I really am confused. We're just gonna walk up to the mysterious object. It's gonna be great. Oh, Atreus is gonna have to stab it, maybe. Okay. Roy, your knife. Well, what have we got? Some sort of travel stone. Let me see. Great our dumbless others. That's the Unity Stone. You know it. I wasn't sure it existed. If Tyr possessed this, that explains how he could visit all the realms and other lands to boot. He held this. In the panel in Odin's library. Yes. Yes, that's it. I understand now. It shows Tyr walking the realm between realms. You know how you must never stray from the path. Well, Tyr always followed his own path, if you catch my meaning. The realm between realms. A path to Jotunheim complete. So you're saying Tyr's shrine showed him stepping off the branch of the world tree. And you're thinking, to reach the secret path to Yodanon, that's what we need to do? I am. Oh dear. That is what you're thinking, isn't it? Well, if that's what we're all thinking, I suppose... Well, we were not going that way. We never intended to go that way. We meant to go this way. Th this way, yes. I guess this way we go. But wouldn't hurt to get a resurrection stone while we're here, right? We bought our resurrection stone. Now we're into the realm between the realms. Here we go. I am so glad that it just grayed out everything else because I was very confused. I was like, wait, where are we going? We're going to the realm between realms. We have a purpose here. If you're thinking about hurling us all into the void, I hope you're quite sure. You suggested this, Mimir. Find your own path. <laughs> yes, he did suggest this. <laughs> I love it when I'm thinking exactly what the game says. That's my favorite. Okay, it's time to eat ourselves off the path. This is what we were told not to do five million times. Here we go. This is where Tyr stepped beyond and the Unity Stone protected him. Ready? Ready. Well, if this is it, lads, it's been an honor. Our faith head. Gonna be so nauseous without a stomach. Come on, that was great. Look, the tower. I knew there was something down here. Amazing. How do you hide something that exists in all realms? Cast it out of any realm to the space between. Clever old tear. Is Jotunheim on the other side? Can't be that. 
It's not like you go through Vanaheim to reach the Midgard Peak. But how do we use it? I'd suggest we look inside, but stay alert. Tyr's little challenges are never as simple as they appear. I have noticed. <laughs> well, hey, last time we skipped the challenge and we just jumped straight to flipping the temple. So maybe we can just brute strength our way through this one. You never know. You never know. Well, this is sparse. The pedestal. Four doors, hmm? Terrifying. A health stone and a rage stone. Absolutely terrifying. What's that? Okay, we're pretty full on both, so I guess we'll just... Well, if we're about to leave this room, maybe we'll use this now just in case. We'll leave the other... We'll leave the health stone if we need it later. Mm, I'm nervous. Hopefully we don't need that to get it's back. Absorbing the stone's energy. Something's happening. Is it moving? It's moving. It knows what to do. The stone served its purpose. We're fulfilling to your spell. What happens now? No idea, brother. But after that fall, I'm sure we're past the worst of it. Are you sure? Oh, no, this is considerably worse. <laughs> Okay, how much of this are we gonna have to do is my question. Luckily there, ooh, yeah, beep, 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 beep. Why would I even say something like luckily there anything? Obviously, we are not lucky. What's next, though? I'm sure there's a next. I'm sure there's a next. Okay. Oh, looks like Alpha. What the? Gotta kill the big bad like this. That way we don't die early on. You really have to stop getting away from me, honestly. Oh, good. We can even do that from the sky. We really need to, yeah, focus on him. Oh, not these things. Fire behind, you. behind me or yeah, okay, behind me. Okay. I'm gonna take those things out for sure. That was a lucky parry because that was not my intention. Stop moving. Okay, we're getting there. Come back, please. No, I can't see. Okay, we should wolves. Now I can't see. We'll wait for this to be over and then we'll wolves. We're blind again. <laughs> I have no idea where this guy is!
Okay, we got him. All right, those things really give me a challenge. Okay, well, we should heal up so that we can be nice and prepared. Oh no, we're back in hell. Okay, switching to Chaos Blades. Is this gonna be an overwhelm thing again? Seems like it. Okay, a little bit of that. Good, 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 good. Fantastic. Yeah, I'm aware. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm moving. I'm dodging. I'm deflecting. We're vocal hosting. We're r 3 Yeah, just tossing that guy. We gotta really focus on one at a time. This guy's level four, and I do fear that, so... Hey, but he blocked my attack and made it so that I couldn't attack. So maybe we switch some lesser... Okay, this is a good time. Goodbye! Fantastic. You're taken care of. Surely that's enough of that. Surely not. I'm sure I'm certain there's more. Certainly more to come, I imagine. Okay. Muscle high. This one's the red one. Good. Okay. Just a little bit of wolfer. I just say it did. There's two of them. You came from but nowhere. An ogre and a troll at the same time. Well, see, the thing about the ogres is you can use them to attack your foe. Hey! Hey! No! You leave him alone. So now I'm going to use the ogre to attack. To attack the troll. See? See how that works? Yeah, get out of here, Dowdy Mooner. Get out of here, Dowdy Mooner. Yeah, that's right. Now we take on the lesser foes. Now we get lit on fire. Good. That was the intention. That was always the plan. Okay, running. Running. Good. Taking out the lesser enemies. Dodging the whole time. Dodging again. Good, good, good. What if we just threw something? I, that was... Okay. A little bit overkill. Not what I really meant to do, but it honestly worked out great. Honestly, made me a little bit nervous. Whew. I got pretty close to death there. But as it turns out, Kratos' Spartan Rage came at just the right time. Perfect, perfect, perfect. What's next? Why are we looking at the big door? Oh, good. That was it. Okay, fantastic. Where are we? And I got a light runic attack out of it. Fantastic, a slash attack that protects Kratos by pushing away all nearby enemies. I like it, but not enough is the thing. I really like the damage ability. Okay, well, let's heal up a little bit and then be on our merry way because that was no problem. Not a problem for Kratos and Atreus. Just two dudes on a mission. Look, we're back in Midgar. There's the bridge. We did it. The tower's back where it belongs. Now Tyr's travel room can take us to Jotunheim. How did Tyr do this? 
Odin suspected the giant secretly possessed some remnant of primordial Jotnar creative essence, the stuff all realms are made of. The Unity Stone must have been fashioned from that essence. To trust an outsider with it, even Tyr, tells you just how desperate they were. And look! Now we can finally light all the braziers and see what happens. Not that I've done that, because I haven't. Another name. Goindel. It's as if they've been made into a memorial to the Valkyries. Hmm. Well then. I see the World Serpent is just watching us. Just chilling. As we make our way downtown. Walking fast. Paces fast. I don't think that's how it goes. I assume this is the direction we're going. Are Brock and Sindri here too? How did you get here? We're supposed to be in the realm between realms, or are we not anymore? I don't know. Honestly, I got a little I got a little lost there. We were in Tears Temple. I don't know what we'll find when we get to Jotunheim, but we must cover our tracks. Odin's ravens will tell him of the tower's restoration, and we mustn't let our efforts be to his benefit. Ah, uh, I see, I see. Okay, so that whole mission was just to bring the Jotunheim tower back here, which seems to me like maybe not the smartest idea considering what Odin wants to do to the giants and what lengths Tyr went through to hide that tower. But what do I know? I'm just a girl. I guess we're going to Jotunheim. Wait a minute. This isn't going to work. What? There's no travel crystal. Tyr must have used his own eyes to refract the energy. It was his final failsafe. You've got eyes like him, Amir. I've got an eye. One! Odin plucked out my other eye precisely to keep me from traveling. Sorry, lads. Thought that would work. What did Odin do with your other eye? He'd have kept it. In any of a hundred places, I'm afraid. You've come so far. There has to be a way. Look, a bit of a long shot. For years, I'd see Sindri, sometimes Brock, lurking around in that mountain when Odin came for his visits. Maybe they know something. Brock and Sindri! Ah, uh, this game is like a master class in building tension and then prolonging it. Because the whole game is structured around we just have to do this one more thing. We just have to do this one more thing. Okay, one more thing. Okay, just one more. And then <laughs> we have to do just one more thing. And it's so frustrating because if you're in a place in your life where your whole life feels that way, like you are just one step away from reaching your goal for years on end. It's extremely frustrating to play a game that 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 plays into that. It like physically hurts when it's like, okay, I thought we were done. Nope, still not done. Ugh. This is it. Let's finish this game. Oh wait, we have to get an eyeball first. Because of course we do. Because of course we're not to Jotunheim yet. Ugh. Okay, so to recap, for those of you who are just joining in, welcome. My name is Brianna White. My tag is the strange rebel. 
Uh, I'm really going over the basics here for those of you who are new here, because it seems like actually there are a lot of new people here, which I'm so grateful for. I'm so glad you're here. WT, thank you for resubscribing. I appreciate your support all that time. Um, if you're new here, I really like to be in gameplay immersed mode, which is what I call it. But it basically means I try not to split my attention between the game and the chat because I tend to miss things in the game if I do that. And I really want to give the end of this game like all the attention it deserves so I can pick up all those tiny little details. So I take moments like this to pause and interact with you because you deserve lots of love and attention, same as the game. Um, but I just won't be doing it at the same time. Please don't backseat game. Please don't spoil anything. And no fisticuffs, you know? Have a good time. Make a new friend. Uh, the Strange Rebel Gaming community is lovely and our chat is very welcoming and friendly. Um, anything else? Great. Fantastic. Love it. All right. Yes, music's on. Great. Okay, here we go. So off to find an eyeball. Not just any old eyeball. A Mimir eyeball. A glowing yellow eyeball. Rock and Sindri, answer our questions or else. Hey guys, question for you. Anyone know where we can find Mimir's other eye? Oh. <laughs> Classic injury. That's... I'm sorry. As a matter of fact, Odin asked me to... He wanted me to build a... Out with it, boy! He showed it to me, you see, and I... Okay. The coin. Sorry, will you... Excuse me? Who? Well, that was useless. You know, it was about that same time that Odin came around looking for me to build a statue with some sort of hidden compartment. Now, that not being a weapon and the Aesir being a bunch of box-speckled cockers, I too saw fit to decline. But I know we got it built just the same. What was the statue? It's that one of Thor out there flashing his sack to the lake. Rock! The statue that the serpent ate. Sorry about that. Feeling much better. How are we supposed to look inside the snake? Inside? Oh no! Just absolute ridiculousness. We better go see what the world serpent has to say about that. Well, lads, I don't know what lies ahead. But now would be a good time to make sure your gear is ready for the worst. Anything you need to do, I'd do it now. Just some sage advice. Okay. Thank you, Mimir, for that little Let's heads up. It. Seems like that was like a hintity hint hint hinterson. Hinterinal dinal. Okay. Um, what is this? I can craft this oh my gosh amazing okay not the point though right son what is he wearing right now he's wearing a legendary sharpshooter enemies in air take increased damage i do like that rapid firing increased damage additional damage Choke enemies, increases stun, enemies choked. I don't like that. Health stones, health stones, arrows, additional status damage. Eh. I like what he's wearing. Got something else in mind? The only thing else we could do, I mean, we have... I think we might use this, honestly, but... It's only, it's only a rare. We can't upgrade any of these. I don't know. We just don't use the defensive one that Next much. Time, I guess. I don't know. Should we change out our talisman? But the, this talisman has the, the double socket. This one has it too. 
I don't know. Maybe we'll use like the epic punch more. We just don't really have a runic build, you know? But I do use the runic attack pretty much every time it's up. I don't know, maybe we should have a runic build. I, it's too many What's hard questions, you know? Let's try it. Where is it? Not that one. We just, we have all these resources to spend. We might as well spend it, you know? Uh, let's try it. So we bought it. Now let's close out and upgrade it. As much as we can. Yeah, this one, we're gonna attack. How much can we upgrade you? Okay, so you are upgraded to max now. So now if I compare you, oh, but then we will lose both of our sockets. Now about that other thing. What? What about that other thing? Our mission to go find an eyeball? Yeah, I don't want to lose both of our... Ugh. We just don't use this. Maybe if we just switch it out for this and then switch out the enchantments. I don't know. We'll we'll try the punchy guy. Don't stand in front of me, Atreus. I still don't really know what you do with this like ripple thing, but you know, let's equip it. I'm terrified of it because I punched Atreus in the face one time with it, but let's just see. Let's see if we use it more than the defensive thing. What's more to the horn? Ring around the rosy. Okay, here we go. We must speak to the world serpent. That was not enough of a vocal warm up. You need at least 15 minutes. It might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Fun! Ew. Really? By the by, he's not wild about it either. <sighs> okay. Of all the fantastical environments that I thought I might find myself in. So in this game. Letting the serpent swallow us? You do not have to come. Well, I'm not gonna miss this. <laughs> I did not think that we would go inside the world serpent. I did not think that. But I don't know why I didn't think that, honestly. Kind of kind of fits the vibe, really. How's the fastest way to a boat here? Alright. Is our boat gonna go inside too? Are we gonna brush some teeth sure while we're in there? No. Here we go. Well, brothers, I've been to many strange places, but this will be a new one. Fun. Yeah. I've never been in a giant's belly either. Here I'm we like go. Never one that was not trying to eat. You really should expect that sort of response at this point. This is fun. This is the kind of fun thing that you do in games. That's just like so unexpected, so unique. 
and really is a a good like writing choice, director choice, all around good choice. Very, it, it feels like adventurous, you know, like like Pinocchio, like old school adventure. I like it. Area discovered, belly of the beast. Funny, I used to dream about getting eaten. Dreams are nothing. I'm not afraid. It just reminded me of a way I used to feel when I was a child. Let's find that statue. Like, what is the liquid below us? Is it like, are we already in belly acid? Is this is it stomach it acid? Not as bad as I thought it'd be. But like heather ale fermenting. Rather pleasant, actually. Oh, Mimir, no. Okay, I guess he swallowed some gold. That's fine. He swallowed a few things, it seems like. The water kind of burns in here. That is water, isn't it? Hi. We can beach over here. All right Bam. then. The hammer. Wait, I see a treasure chest, and I must needs get. Ooh, and some gold. Must needs get that, and then we'll pick that up. And Atreus, definitely stick your water into the stomach acid. Great, good talk. Can we beach here. Yes, here. Okay, great. Take. Okay, now where to next is the question. Look at all the different things he's swallowed. So many different things. Okay, we'll dock here. It's so nice of him to build a dock inside of his body. So kind. Oh. I see something over there. Oh, and a whole puzzle for us. Thank you, World Serpent. Thank you for swallowing a whole puzzle for us. <laughs> Definitely smash these things. Absolutely we need to do that. All right then, puzzle time it is. What does that do for us, though? I don't think that ever got closer, but I feel like it could. Oh, we're bringing that thing around, huh? Okay. Yeah, just definitely miss. Oh, Atreus, don't tell me what to do. Mocking me, I know what to do. I just don't know how to do it. Where are we going? <laughs> Why did we climb on top of this thing? <laughs> Hello? Ah, there, 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 there. Camera angles. <laughs> Camera angles! There, there! Get it! <laughs> Hello? There we go, okay. Ah! <laughs> okay, to the side then. We're gonna do it. Okay, 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 okay. And there. Alright, alright, alright. Nobody panic! <laughs> Everything's fine. Forget something? No. Atreus, I know how to solve this puzzle. Stop trying to help me. I'm smart. I'll marble punch you again. Come here. Any idea where Odin hid your eye? No. It's not like I can still see through it. Ew, what is that? What is that attached to? Do you think they had to like look up snake anatomy? They must have, right? Like the the character designers were like, 
Okay, okay, okay. So what does the inside of a snake look like? Take. Look at this shiny gold treasure chest. I like it. What's inside? A runic attack? An eye. Oh, yep. that makes sense. That's, That's what we're here for. Maybe yeah. you should stick that in my head for safekeeping. Gently now, gently. Yeah. Thank you, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone. It's true. Oh, another take. This time, something for me. A symbol of bounty. What does that do? Symbol of bounty. Runic and luck. I do like luck. Oh, that's better than what we have equipped currently right here. I like it. Forget defense. We're undefeatable. Okay, and then I think this just takes us right down to the boat, which is fantastic because all we needed was this eyeball. Let me just saunter on out of here. How's it feel, Mimir? Well, I wouldn't say I'm feeling whole again, but it's a right improvement. The Bifrost is intact. It'll serve. Then we have all we need. Finally, we're going to Yudna. There's no stopping us now. Don't say Why, that, have though. You had the town yes, the exactly. You can't just say there's no stopping us now. It's really hard to see so in here. We, back out? we say <laughs> Hold on. What's going on? Okay. Well, that was mildly terrifying. Maybe our presence is upsetting Jormungandr's belly. No, something is wrong. Oh, iceberg! Dead ahead! We're, we're, we're wrecked. What's happening to us? Nothing good. This is absolutely a trace. Well, that's fault. over. Yeah, I have a feeling. Is he what is that? Yeah, I'm you gonna guess Baldur's outside. More, I'm gonna guess Atreus was like, there's no stopping us now, and now Baldur is gonna be like, knockity knock knock, I feel nothing. Hold tight and watch your balance. The board shifting! I'm gonna I have you! When Kratos told Atreus to hold tight, I sort of feel like... No, not death. What? Boy? Boy? Ooh. Yeah, I really feel like I'm getting kind of used to this. Kratos should have held on to Atreus, not the boat. What happened to him? Something we did? No. Something else. A giant. Why would the serpent leave us here? Look. Oh. Freya. We can still trust her. Right? And we're gonna end it there. I'm sorry. At this point. I have to end on a cliffhanger because everything here is a cliffhanger. You know what I mean? Like we're getting so close to the end. Like there's no good stopping point. You're always going to want more. That's how this game works. And we'll get there. I promise we are so close to the end. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you thought. Uh, let me know what you're thinking. Let me know how you're doing. Let me know how your day was. Let me know what self-care you're doing. I want to hear from you you. Take a second to like the video if you enjoyed it. 
share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, please remember to subscribe to Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next episode. That's all, officially, for this video. Okay, bye!